Hello, this is John. Today we're gonna to be moving a Clark. Got the crane up. I not move these and get everything taken apart. Forklift engine, draining coolant right now, catching it in the pan. There's everything there. Move the plugs, get all your wiring off. Gonna have to move this separator plate right here. The reason we're moving the plugs to make the engine easier to turn over. There's everything else. All the wiring's off the engine. Just gotta get the separating plate undone. Then undo the bell housing bolts and my coolant hoses and she's ready to come out. Today is day two on the forklift. Uh, yesterday we got the engine out, got everything switched around on it, got it reinstalled, got the uh, ROPS or the rollover protection put back on, which I don't believe it's called rollover protection. It's pretty much just to keep stuff from falling off the forklift and hitting you. It doesn't have a rollover protection uh, deal on it. But, we're going to head out there today because I went to try to start it up last night and I was 180 out on the timing, which it happens, but today it's an easy fix. We're going to go out and pop the distributor, rotate it 180, set it back in, and fire it up and then fine tune it, take it out, see what we got on it, and I'll get back and maybe uh, give some highlights of it. But today is a little different than yesterday. Yesterday was beautiful out. Today is windy. So hopefully we don't get anything inside the engine. It's a brand new engine. So I chose to do it outside, which might have been a bad spot. But with the crane out and truck running, it's not really the best thing to do indoors. But on that notion, you guys, I'll see you guys in a bit. No lights on. Let's go for a little drive.
there's the new engine. Everything's looking good and clean on it. No coolant leaks. No oil leaks. All good.